Bob Green here, volunteer with the Martin Fleischmann Memorial Project. Okay, so we have our little jewel here, uh, which you might have recognized. And this came from this end of the reactor on kind of this side. And unfortunately, uh, where it might have cast a shadow um, that was where the cut line came through. So unfortunately, uh, it's difficult to see uh, anything there. However, I did notice at this end of the reactor on this side, and I'll take up some close-up photos, uh, here, uh, a very similar shape to this with our cutout, our, our little square cutout here on this side. And that marries up with this feature, uh, which looks like two round blobs, almost like the impression of a swirling torus. And we're going to take some close-up photos of that. So if I actually align that, this comes over and drops in right above that feature there. So if I take that off, you'll see that we have this blemish on here. And if I put that down there, that lines up. And then on the other side, we also have this blemish. And there is a blemish that matches here. So um, if we drop that on there, uh, like so, it goes on like somewhere there. So that blemish here lines up with the blemish there and if you actually look uh, inside uh, I can try and get this a closer focus here so we have the the blemish here and around the other side we have this blemish so it's kind of going through the tube uh, and affecting it as it goes through. And you'll see that here we've got our shape where it's affecting the alumina with our little cutout in the corner. And then on this side, we've got a similar affected or a different affected area on the quartz on the other side. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take a, a series of photos of these uh, three, four areas. One on here. Uh, the one on the other side of here, this I think is quite telling, and the one on here, if that makes sense to you. So I'll take a little bit closer up video. Just looking at the scale there, so it's about 8 mil in diameter, well, across the width of the two vortices that are captured on the quartz there. Uh, there is an outer ring which is larger, and I guess that's probably 12 uh, from the outer to the other side. This is the other side. Is it related? I don't know, but it's the other side. And the wire was uh, there. I'll just shift it so that you can see the whole shape. 